Welcome ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to my channel. Please, before we get the video started, do not hesitate. Hit that subscribe button down below and drop me a like if you really feeling my stuff. I do appreciate you all coming and finding me. Hey, let's have some fun today. When it comes down to the, the manga this week, I try something different. So, shout out to King of Lightning. King of Lightning is probably one of, like, my number one inspiration, like, top top one inspiration to making a YouTube channel just because of how much fun and energy he puts into his reactions, reviews, and discussions and all these different things. So, he has, yeah, like, I found him a long time ago, like, back during the... I think I found him during the fourth Shinobi War arc. That's when I first found out about him. And like one of the first videos I saw was Kakashi Sucks. <laughs> and I was like, yo, you're not finna talk about my homie like that. And then he talked about my homie like that. And I was like, hmm. I've been saying a lot of shit about, about this dude. Hmm. He might have a point. So I found out about him. And like throughout my time subscribed to his channel, I see that he talks about this one manga with this really cool looking art it just you know it it had so many chapters i had that like that one piece fear where it's just a daunting number of chapters you don't really want to catch up to it because it's so long even though you literally caught up to like my hero academia and fucking other manga so he talked about this one manga called kingdom and i was like Ooh wee he's like mad excited about this I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to give it a try. I told some people on YouTube, I'm going to give it a try. So this is me giving it a try. And I said, I'm going to start with my same rules for an anime where I'm only going to read three chapters and then I'm going to just fucking, I'm going to get my thoughts on it. All right. That didn't work. I read fucking five chapters and I'm hooked. This shit is nice. I, I, I'm really enjoying it. I'm glad that I took a leap and I just you know decided to listen to the masses sometimes people in the comment section be knowing what they talking about right so i went ahead and i read kingdom and i gotta say the shit is fucking dope so from what i'm reading from kingdom we are in two, it, 245 bc west china west side and we got my boy look i'm gonna tell y'all this now i can't pronounce nobody's name and i'm not gonna embarrass myself in the first video trying to pronounce nobody's name so this is what we're going to do. we throw throwing nicknames at everybody. So, for example, the main character, my boy, X. <laughs> Look, I don't know what else to call him. He's going to be Red X and Teen Titans. Next, we got the little kid in the chicken suit, Krillin. Just because he reminds me of Krillin for some reason. Don't know why. Then we got the pretty dude, the pretty king dude. Guess what his name is? Haku from Naruto. I know the truth. I know that's Haku. You can't play with me. He just got bigger eyes. He's opened his eyes more. Next, we got Damian Wayne from Batman. But, you know, he's the king's little brother. So, that's basically it. So, what happens in the story is Red X has a best friend. Him and his best friend are orphans. So, every day they go and they play fight each other trying to get better. Because their whole goal is to have their name. Like, they want to join the army. So, they can become generals and get their rank and stature up. And they get some mansion, get some hoes, get some boats, get some boats and hoes. And then they can go ahead and live life and have their name known throughout all under the heavens or something along those lines. Terrible quote. So, one day, they see, like, this fancy dude comes up. He's like, oh, man, they throwing hands. I like this shit. Hey, I like you kids. What's y'all names? They tell them their names. I'm not going to repeat it. Pretty kid. Look, Haku, number one. In Red X, cool. So, old boy goes and he talks to the dude that technically owns them or takes care of them, the village leader. Not gonna pronounce his name. And he's like, Yo, them two little ass kids out there that beat the shit out of each other. Hey, I want the one that looks like Haku from Naruto. And he's like, Oh, bet. I love Naruto too. Hell yeah, you could take him. You want the other one? I don't like that little motherfucker either. He's like, Nah, nah, I just want the one. So, the one kid, Haku, gets adopted, and the other kid's all like, you know what? I ain't even hate on you. Go have fun. Go be great. You got this. Two months later, Haku shows up back in front of Red X, and he's dead, or he's dying. And now, everybody's like, oh, shit, what the fuck happened? Turns out that the king's little brother, who we haven't seen yet, haven't seen them yet, is lead, like led a rebellion. 
to try and kill the king. All right, we got that. Oh, okay, cool. So they took Haku all the way over there, and Haku somehow survived the slaughter, and he made his way back to give Red X a map. All right, Red X cries, and he's like, don't worry, dog. I'll never forget you. I'll avenge you. I'll kick a motherfucker's ass when I find out who did this to you. So he goes on the little mission, and he fucking finds, uh, ooh, excuse me. I'm sorry. See, look, I did it all over again. So he goes, and he finds fucking, like, the little place that he was told to go, and this is a little ass shed. Turns out that the person inside is the king. Guess who the king looks like? Haku. He's literally Haku number two. Both beautiful looking motherfuckers with big ass eyes. All right. Got it. So from there, an assassin, ah, damn, an assassin was chasing them. So the assassin's chasing him. He, fat, he tracks Red X all the way to the king looking dude. And now Haku and Red X are talking. Red X is pissed because he's like, why the hell do you look like my, my homie? And he's like, mm, who are you? Mm, hands off me and then the assassin dude shows up red x fights the assassin dude and we get a flashback where haku one and haku two are not, uh, talking to each other and he's like yo trust in my homie red x red x is harder than me he just you know he can step up to the plate so red x kills the assassin all will find a good now we moving on because elsewhere or at the same time we finally are shown who the king's little brother is and this little motherfucker this like this little shithead is no shit damian wayne who like walks with his hand behind his back and he's got this big fucking the hills have eyes looking motherfucker following him around doing whatever he says crushing people with his hands so damian wayne's logic is because the king uh, the current king haku too has a different mother his mother was a dancer from compton all right I don't know what you're hating on her for. She's just out here trying to get her money, support her OnlyFans, shit like that. And he's like, I'm just trying to get rid of all this fucking fake punk bitch ass non-royal blood in here. Especially fucking, I'm not going to pronounce his name, the chancellor who bribed his way to the top. Something along those lines. So that's why he uh, he started the rebellion. That's where I stopped right there. Five episodes or five chapters. Felt like episodes. Great shit. Amazing artwork. I can't see what I can't wait to see what happens next. I'm I'm excited to keep going. With all that being said, I feel like this is one I'm gonna stick around with for a while. I had a thought. I had a thought to uh, kind of mooch. So another thing that I've been watching recently is the One Piece Virgin podcast, and I was like, oh, bet I can get somebody who already found Kingdom, and I could do that too. I kind of don't want to ride somebody else's wave. So with that being said, I'm just gonna let y'all know that all right this is where i'm at and it's probably gonna be five chapters these are longer chapters but i don't know if five is gonna do it justice so i'm gonna have to look up like the arcs so i'm gonna probably follow the same format but i'm not just gonna record the same podcast you know what i mean i'm down to do a discussion but i don't want to like i said ride somebody else's wave i'm not gonna say the other word now with that